Hola, senorita. Okay, I'm on holidays, obviously. I've actually been on holidays for two days now, but I only started the vlog today just because, well, like, you just don't need to say a week. Like, a week is just a bit boring. Like, you just don't need to say a whole week of me on holidays. Whenever I'm literally doing the exact same thing every single day. Oh, I'm in Ibiza, sorry. I'm here with my mum, my dad, and my sister. Today's Tuesday, and we got here on Sunday. Our flight was at seven in the morning, so we had to be at the airport for like, I can't, even, I can't remember what time the flight was actually. Basically, I did go out on Saturday. I did just end up staying up the whole night until like half four. It was honestly the biggest regret of my life. I lay down, I think I stayed at my boyfriend's because my family was staying at mine. And I think I got into bed at like four and was like, I'm just gonna like lie down for a bit, but I didn't sleep. My daddy rings me at half four to say he's outside and honestly, I thought like tears were, were gonna trickle down my face. I have never felt so ill. I opened like the front door and I just was like projectile vomit and like walking towards the car. My daddy was just staring at me out the window. It was so bad. We had to like pull the taxi over so I could be sick out the door. Um, I slept the whole plane right though, however, obviously, because I hadn't slept in like 24 hours. So the plane, I actually don't, don't really remember any of it. We, I think I woke up once and I went straight back to sleep and then we got in here and I slept again. And then I went Sunday then and here we are and I actually don't want to drink the whole holiday because that one hangover flipped me. It's about two o'clock now. I just came down to make some lunch because we have like our own way like um kitchen bit and then like living room and then obviously like the rooms. I have this hat on because my forehead like it... Mommy said it doesn't look like it's burning, but it feels really, really sore. Like my skin feels really, really sensitive. But I'm gonna go back up and sunbathe now. I'll show you about like my, like where we're staying and stuff. I'll have to be careful though, because obviously I don't wanna like film other people. Like I'm sure they wouldn't want that. I've got really shitty tan lines because I just didn't attempt to even get rid of them yesterday. And also how ugly is this bikini? It's actually hideous, but I don't really care because it came, I got it from Shane and it came the day before I was supposed to go. I said, like, what's the point of returning this here? And I also didn't have that many bikinis. So I was like, fuck it, I'm just gonna take it. It is kind of ugly. It's got this here like really granny print on it. It's like the type of print that would be in a, it'd be the type of print that's on a bed in a hotel. It actually kind of looks like they're curtains. And I just took selfies in the toilet mirror and I actually really like the selfies, but I'm wearing like the ugly bikini and I'm like, why did I, why did I not put on a nicer bikini to take these photos? Also guys, this book, Ugly Love, are you gonna focus? It's the same author as It Ends With Us. I think this is better than It Ends With Us. I am quite a bit through, as you can see, and I'm absolutely raging because I only brought, why is this not focusing? I only brought this one book and I wish I brought another one because reading a book is actually so much better, I think, than like listening to your phone and stuff because you just get so hot. I, I just get so hot and stuff. So whenever I put the, my sunglasses on, like set up and read this here, I'm actually a lot more content and I'm still sunbathing. And after I finish this one, I don't have another one. But Ellen does have normal people and she's nearly finished it. And she was like, we could swap. But I already watch normal people. And if I'm honest, I have no interest in reading the book. Like I already know what happens. Maybe I will just read it anyway. Okay, so this is what it's like when you come out of um, our like we building. Really cute. And then there's a lot of different poles. Basically, there's like a main pole. That's really busy, as you can tell. So warm. And then there's also a kids pole up there. And then basically the pool that we go to is the one that's like on the roof. It's so cool and it's like an adults only pool and it kind of like looks out. Um, it's not an infinity pool, is that what they're called? It's not that, but it like looks out on a really nice view and you can see like the ocean. Oh, also these are literally the only shoes I brought with me. So every single outfit, every single photo, they're just gonna be in them. I don't know how much they're gonna be able to hear because of that music or how much I'm even gonna be allowed to keep in because of that music. But basically I'm up, like we're up somewhere the night. I left a wee bit later to vlog because um, it's quite small up here and everyone here is English. So everyone would be able to understand me. It's just filled with Irish and English people. But um, this is like the sunbathing bit. This is like where we are, as you can see, it like looks up. I'll show you the pool in a wee minute, but there's people in it staring right at me. Let's just go we walk actually. So here's our lovely views. And over there we've got like the bar. There's Ellen and my daddy. And then that's the pool beside me. Oh, is that what my hair's look like the whole time? I'm just out of the pool so I'm drying off before I go back down now. And then I think we're gonna get ready for dinner. I think we're just gonna eat in the hotel and then go for a walk um, like a bar somewhere. The hotel food's actually really good. Okay, I'm coming out here to vlog. Just got ready for dinner. I'm going back inside because there's people out here. Okay, we're back inside. It's just horrible lighting in here. Here's my outfit. Ellen, so we've got a bit of a sunburn back, so she's chilling. I'm feeling a little bit uh, 
like red on the chest as well if I'm honest um, this is my outfit I got the skirt in Primark and the waistcoat and the waistcoat's real collision that sounds bad by the way there was one of us was on the sofa, one of us was on the, the single bed in the room and I took the single bed in the room. Um, I haven't waited for my daddy to get out of the bathroom so I can brush my teeth and put lipstick on. I got our food. Me and Ellen got pizzas. I got margarita. Look how good this garlic bread looks. I got a wee red wine. Mama got carbonara. Oh, poor daddy's hasn't came yet. Daddy kept swapping our wines because mine had more than his. So he kept swapping it so I had his and had a wee dribble left. So he's just had to, he's just had to get himself a whole new glass. Okay, so we've came and we walked down to like some of the bars and places that are close to us. It is, um, it is like pitch black here. It's so funny, Daddy, because look at the other side of the island. So like obviously, like I said, we're on the side where the sun doesn't set, so the sky just gradually gets lighter over there. But it's still so nice. Okay, we came to this wee Spanish bar, and then we all got some drinks. I got a wee steak on the beach. Delicious. I only got a Cosmo. Porn star. Daddy got a beer. And here's our. Let me show them how well your bag matches your dress. <laughs> Hold that strap. It couldn't match any better if she tried. That looks blue in this light. It's not. Good morning. Okay, so this morning we are going off to like flea markets I think. Uh, uh, flea markets, hippie markets, I don't really know what they call them here so we're literally booking a taxi now. I think it's like 11 o'clock. I'm wearing this wee um, set from Pretty Little Thing. I love this watch. Look how pink my birthmark is when the sun. It goes like so much darker. We are sitting down now. I'm severely red. They weren't a major success. I got Paul a bracelet. It's supposed to be 20 euro, haggled it down to 15. I was hoping to get a wee um, fake Louis somewhere. And now we're waiting on my daddy to come back. I think we have all agreed that the flea markets are probably shite. Yeah, pretty shite. Probably not worth the time unless you're like a 70 year old woman. Like okay, Angelina, we're- Angelina, the ballerina, the bunny rabbit. Ellen's never did this hairstyle. <laughs> Ellen's never did this straight back on hairstyle and I was like, can you get on the bandwagon? Like, so she... <laughs> like, like I'm wearing a bald cap. So tonight she's doing it, but the thing is, it's all mine, so we're both gonna have the same hairstyle. I don't have the gel that I norm normally use, so we have to use this glue and it is honestly like tarmac. I'm gonna attempt to fix Ellen now, like, sit down. I look like I'm wearing a top with these two <laughs> straps. Also, the bun needs to be pulled so tight. Yeah, yeah but I think my ponytail's not tight enough. And then, yeah, right, okay, well then let me do this and then you can tighten the ponytail. No, you do all that, you tighten oh, the ponytail. Oh my god. I took the longest to get ready and, you oh lord. <laughs> no, I, I don't need to do the ponytail yet. Yes, you do, it's Ellen, not tight Ellen, enough. Ellen, trust me, I am going to tighten, I can tell it's not tight enough, it's fucking pulled out <laughs> everywhere. They have two bits hanging down. No, they're glued back. <laughs> they're not getting any. I think I should have these wee bits like that curl. I can't do those well, like, okay? I mean, you haven't even gelled half of it. Like, this bit doesn't have any gel. This actually looks like quite good on yours. There's so much glue on my hair. There's so much glue, Ellen, and that's the way it has to be. That's it, that's the type, because it's creating bumps in it. it again. <laughs> no, I'm not gluing it again. I need to get rid of my cycle. Oh I think I need this wear it like this. I think. Wear it like this. <laughs> I think I need the spiky bit. I wish I <laughs> Yes, I can see it, Kitty. If you could just stop touching my back and tie my hair up. It still doesn't feel tight. <sighs> okay, we're walking to dinner now. Um, I'm wearing this wee dress from Pretty Little Thing. We did book a taxi and we were waiting like 20 minutes and then these like ladies come out and they were English and they were like, oh yeah, it's like an hour wait for the taxis at night, like at this time. And we were like flip six. So we're just walking. And to be fair, it's not long of a walk. It's just like direct sun. It's just so warm, but it doesn't really matter about walking. And I think we're going to this Mexican place. They have these, they had five euro cocktails before seven o'clock, but it's now seven o'clock. But to be honest, I don't even really think I fancy any alcohol you know me not really much of a social drinker just drink to get hammered and i don't think i'll really be doing that this whole day so oh, i also didn't scrape my hair up in a bun and i kind of wish i did because like i said it's really warm we're going down to where we were last night which is that like the marina it's so nice so it is our views 
We're at the restaurant now. I keep having to pat my Sula. I'm having a bit of technical difficulties. And we just had nachos, which were obviously clearly really nice. I'll put in a picture of what they looked like before, but I just could not be bothered to grab my camera because everyone was um, reaching for them and I just needed to get my hands in there as well. Food came, I got a burger. Mmm, I think Mexican is now my favorite cuisine. And I had to go tie my hair up. Uh, okay. Um, I am absolutely fucked after that dinner. I feel like good. Three months pregnant, but we're walking out to find a wee bar. I actually just bought this here necklace. How cute is this here? I am really not like a name necklace person. I think it's because my dad, I always hated them and he's always like, they're so ugly. Like he doesn't like the name necklace. Well, he actually told me he likes this there now and I was like, do you? Yeah. And he's just like normally not a name person or like star signs, like sorry gals. And so I just feel like I'm not a fan. Do you know what I mean? Like I wouldn't get like my name or my star sign like normally. But I just thought this was so cute. I'll definitely wear it for like a weekend and never have it on me again. But it was only eight euro. This is the view. There's Ellen. Ellen shows the hair. We got it eventually. Going nowhere. Good morning. We're up sunbathing again. I'm hitting that pool right now. Do some tricks. Oh guys, look, it's like the wee mini disco night. That's so cute. We're heading out oh, to wow, dinner. Oh wow, I'm so pink. I just didn't vlog that much from today. At least sunglasses also just like, don't really go with my outfit. I've literally copied Ellen's outfit from last night. I just didn't really vlog much because there isn't much to vlog when you're lying around the pool. Like holiday vlog, oh I didn't even curl my eyelashes, fuck. Holiday vlogs are just, like can be so boring sometimes I think. Like what do you do? Unless you're like, going out on all these like boat trips and all during the day and we're just like not doing that there like now we're going out for dinner as you can tell this is a no makeup look tonight after last night it was just so warm i was so uncomfortable with my hair and i was sweating oh, tonight would have been the night to wear makeup because we went out and it's not sunset anymore like the sun's already set so it's not even warm to be fair we were supposed to go into a beat at old town tonight but we decided not to because we wanted to like lie by the pool to late and if we're going into a beat the town we would need to be leaving like slightly earlier because we were going to get like the bus and stuff in because we're about like a 50 euro taxi away so and yeah we just decided that we were gonna go into a beat tomorrow night or we need to tighten my hair again you just like can't see any of my ears. There's my fam. My mum and daddy are the slowest walkers in the world. Dinner's here. Me and mummy got chicken paella to share. And Ellen and daddy got fish paella. Seafood, sorry. Yeah. This is where we're sitting. We're kind of in like this big square, but it's quite cool. My first dessert of the whole day, and it's, it's got like chocolate. I think you pour it over. That is disgusting. I don't want to slime straight off. Okay, so another day has passed and I, what a shock, I did not vlog. Once again, just wasn't that much to vlog. You're so sick of here now. Like I say the same thing every time, I'm like a broken record. We are out now. And now we're getting the bus into Old Town, Abitha Town, whatever it's called. I did like a curly blow dry, put my hair in rollers and look at it. It's basically straight. In fact, it's not straight, it's just frizzy. So I have no idea how long the bus takes us, which is why we we left now so we can kind of hopefully be there for like sunset and stuff. Then get some dinner and then we'll get the bus back. I'm wearing this wee dress from Zara. It's kind of long, you just know me. The shorter the better. And then I'm wearing Ellen's flip-flops, which are high key uncomfortable. And I went for a wee red lip, I haven't worn red lipstick in about two years. Jen, I went off it so much, hated it um was not the vibe and then i just thought you know what i fancy we red lip i walked to the shop and got a red lipstick okay. mom and dad looking pretty beauty secrets thank you mom and dad for the amazing dna okay so we're on the bus now and you have to wear masks still like we went to it on and he was like no no mask which i'm not gonna lie i thought was a thing of the past and i think this is like a half hour bus and i forgot to bring my earphones and I kind of want to run home and get them again, like not going to lie, I am a second to you. fucking human that I can't like look out the window and enjoy these views without my music. I'm going to hold my phone up to my ear and play some city girls. So we're off the bus now. Oh my god, this place is unreal. Like look, boats everywhere. You can't really see, I'll show you whenever we get on down there. Why do people fucking stare at me when I'm vlogging? Like what are you looking at? What are you looking at? <laughs>
on, I couldn't really, I couldn't chat so much was going on, but basically that was Giorgio Armani that was getting off his yacht, that big massive black yacht, it was like the best thing I'd ever seen in my life. And him and like his family were getting off. So I saw Giorgio Romani, I think I saw his son and then actually I saw loads of their like family members, I just didn't know who they were. Ellen just said he's the richest openly gay openly man. Openly gay man in the world. Look at that, is that a boat? But it was quite insane to be honest. Like I just saw loads of people gathered round this like Mercedes van and I was like what's going on down there and then I just saw the big black yacht and I knew that it, it was his yacht because when we were going to like restaurants earlier one of the boys was like oh you just have a great view of Giorgio Romani's yacht and it, we knew we'd seen the yacht then then I just seen his yacht and I just like literally started like speed walking down I could get a good wee look at him but yeah these are all the yachts here oh how the other half live I'm gonna own my own yacht someday guys you mark my words and then this big black one here yeah is his and it's it's the best by far wow look at that even the one beside it's insane he's a big lover of the yachts Giorgio or man i am um, apparently loves sailing around the world as you would if if you own that thing i'd love it as well ellen's got daddy specs on to get a better look at the yacht she wants to see it in hd there's his we we wet sit in there is it branded yeah this yacht's actually better because it's got like two layers, two floors, whatever the hell they're called on a yacht. Guys, it's not a necklace, it's a bloody bracelet. I thought it was a necklace and it's a bracelet. It's the next day. You guys know the drill, there is no pole content in this vlog. Two bronzed queens. <laughs> Okay, so we are in Escanar, I think that's what it's called. We got the bus here for dinner and we're going to like a steakhouse. But the thing is, I think it's quite popular and we didn't book it. So we are chancing our arm. It's such a nice temperature now at this time. Like the sun's nearly set. This wee top is for, from Pull and Bear for anyone that's wondering, but it is old. I think I got it last summer and my necklace. Actually, all my jewelry is Anna Luisa. It's literally my favorite necklace in the entire world. It goes with every single outfit. And yeah, this is our last night. Actually, I forgot to say this is our last day. Our flight tomorrow is... When's our flight, mommy? 10 to 12, so we're out of the apartment at like half nine, which is gonna be a struggle because I haven't got up before 10 any day. Wow, this is cool. Leonardo DiCaprio. Uh, yeah. A young Leonardo DiCaprio yeah, is yeah, my awesome. is celeb it, crush. This is class, look at that. Look, there's David Beckham. I don't understand what this is. Is that Patrick Swayze? Oh no, that's the boy from Pretty Woman. That's Megan's favorite film. Okay, so we're sitting at our table now. We've actually been here Did for ages. Uh, it is like, they said an hour and a half to two hour wait for food, which I don't actually care about because I'm not, I wasn't starving and also it's such a nice temperature now to eat, but how long have we been here? We ordered our food 30, so there's potentially still an hour and a half to go before, before the food comes. It's here and we just got some red wine. We all got sticks and we also got move seats. It's a lot prettier here. Thank you. Guys, I got a brownie. Oh it's god, there's nuts in it. Yeah. Fat nuts. Big fat nuts. These nuts. What's the best brownie? Spins? Spins. Spins. Spins has the best brownie I've ever tasted in my life. I well, my hi, Jersh. I don't like coconut. You can't really see me because it's really dark, but we just came back to the hotel. Um, we just got a taxi back, and I think we're going to sit here and have some drinks. I was drinking red wine for my dinner, so I'm just having more red wine. Oh, sorry, sorry. <laughs> Whoopsies. <laughs> One too many glasses. My hair scraped back like this. Me and Daddy look like twins. Okay, that's the end. We flew home the next day, so um, wasn't really much else to film. I'm so sorry how long it took me to put this vlog up. Like, this vlog is... I literally went holidays over a month ago. Oh, I need to stop doing that with my videos. But anyway, I really hope that everyone enjoyed this video. And yeah, bye.